Hey everybody, I'm in CVS right now. I forgot to record in the car again. I keep doing that. Also, I just like ran out of the house this morning, so I'm like not ready at all. But um, CVS is really slow this week, but I'm gonna try to work with what we got. So I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do. Okay, so first thing I'm gonna do is pick up two of the Garnier Fruitiques. I think I'm gonna go with these this time. Um, and then I am gonna use this paper coupon um it expired on 7 15 but my store does take these if you don't want to use that we do have this principle on coupons.com right now that doesn't expire until 8 5 um so they're two for eight dollars and then there's a three dollar digital that will come off bringing you down to five and then the two dollar or three dollar paper coupon will come off bringing you down to two dollars and then you get back a two dollar extra buck and then I'm gonna do the same exact thing on the whole blends and use the printable from coupons.com and it will work out the exact same way. The whole blends is a separate deal from the Fruitiques. So you will get $2 back for each. Okay, so then I am gonna pick up a shampoo and conditioner for Dove. They are $5.49 each, buy one, get one half. So it'll come to $8.23. And then, hang on, hang on. I am going to use this $3 paper coupon. It did expire, but again, my store will take this. If your store won't, then you can use two of these $1.50 printables, and it'll work out the exact same way. Bring it down to $5.23, and then you get a $2 extra book back, making it a cost of $3.23, or like $1.61 each. But... I'm going to make this deal even better. I'm going to combine all three of them. And then I have a 5 off of 20 hair care that's going to come off. So I'm going to pay around 4 something and get $6 and extra bucks back. Okay, so then I'm over by the Dove deodorant. And in my store, these are not tagged. But they're $9.49. Buy one, get one 50% off. And then when you buy two, you get a $2 extra buck. So I'm going to pick up two. They're going to come to $14.23. I'm going to use this buy one, get one paper coupon that came in our inserts, I think, last Sunday. It's going to take off $7.99, and hopefully it'll glitch with a $2 digital taking off two more dollars, which would make it $4.24 for the pair, and then you get $2 in extra bucks back, bringing it down to $2.24 or $8.12 each. This is actually all I'm going to do on my first transaction, so I'm going to go up and see how it works out. Okay, so that transaction worked out great. You can see all my Garnier, then all my Dove, my paper coupon scanned just fine. My two Garniers glitched. I had the five off 20 CRT come off. I used $10 in extra bucks and then paid 47 cents. So I paid out 10.47. And then I got back two for the whole ones, two for the Fruitiques, two for the Dove shampoo and conditioner and two for the Dove deodorant. So I paid out 10.47, got back eight. That transaction was a cost of 2.47. Okay, so now I'm starting on a new account and this is what I picked up. Three of the Colgate 360 toothbrushes and one of the Colgate smaller 500 milliliter mouthwashes. They're all on sale for 4.99. So four of them is gonna total you 19.96, which is the 98% rule of 20. So the $5 off three digital is going to attach to one of the toothbrushes. And then I'm gonna use two 75 cent digitals for the other two toothbrushes. Then I'm gonna use, or I mean paper coupons, I'm sorry. I got these off of the Colgate website. And then I'm gonna use the 75 cents off for the Colgate mouthwash. That's gonna bring me down to a total of $7.71. And I'm gonna get back $10 in extra bucks because it's buy two, get five, and that's a limit of two times. So it's going to be a $2.29 money maker. Okay, so you know I'm in the CoverGirl Cosmetics. And my store doesn't carry the $4.99 pencils, but they do carry these $5.49 pencils. So I'm going to grab three. Look at that. It's the last three of these. Um, so three of them is going to total me up to $16.47. I have a seven off of 15 CRT that came this week on this account. Then I'm gonna use three of the $3 I coupons. That's gonna bring me down to paying just 47 cents. And then I'm gonna get back $9 in extra bunks. So it's going to be an $8.53 moneymaker. 
Okay, so now I'm checking out the Olay section. I was just kind of scouring for clearance and I found this on sale for $8.87. The Retinol Moisture SPF 30. These. Um, so I picked two of them up. So two of them is going to total $17.71. We have a $12 off to digital that will come off. So you will pay $5.21. And when I looked, it said that it's by to get back ten dollars in extra bucks so if i get the ten dollars back in extra bucks this is gonna be like a four dollar and 79 cent money maker so i can't wait to see how this works out okay so i'm back in the dove deodorant i'm gonna do this deal again even though the glitch didn't work because on this account i have a two dollar off seven dove crt so again two of them should total me up to $14.23. My buy one get one coupon will take off $7.99 and then my CRT for $2 will come off. I'll pay $4.24 and get back $2 in extra bucks making them just $2.24 for the pair or $1.12 each. So this is what my cart looks like for my second transaction. I'm about to go up and cash out. I do have a $4 off my purchase on this transaction. So I think everything here after coupons should be $17.65. And then after the $4 off, it would be $13.65. And then I should get back $10 in extra bucks there. Hopefully $10 in extra bucks here, $9 in extra bucks there, and then $2 in extra bucks there. So let's see how this works out. So here's my receipt. You can see all the Colgates on top and then the Olay's on clearance for $8.87. And then the two Dove deodorants and then the three CoverGirls. All my coupons scanned just fine. My $12 Olay digital came off. My $5 digital for the Colgate didn't come off. My seven off 15 cover girl, $4 off my next purchase, the two off seven dove deodorant. Then I used $13 in extra bucks and paid a subtotal of 11 16. So I paid 24 16 and then I got back $10 for the Colgate, $9 for the cover girl and $2 for the dove deodorant. So I got back 21. So this receipt was only a cost of $2 and 16 cents, right? I think hold on it was a cost of three dollars and 16 cents sorry and um the clearance olay is not giving back the ten dollar extra buck for buying two okay so now i moved on to my account that has a 10 off of 70 and i'm gonna repeat the garnier deals on this account i just noticed that these are included i did scan them on the app and they do say that they're two for eight giving back the two dollar extra buck and the three dollar digital attaches so I think I'm going to grab these two this time and use the $3 printable that'll glitch with the $3 digital, bringing you down to pay $2, and then you'll get the $2 extra buck back. And then I'm going to grab mm, these two, and it's literally the same exact deal, doing the same thing again, just with the Fruitiques coupon. Okay, so I'm by the Febreze Small Spaces and I stumbled across something earlier on my account on accident. So when I scan these, it attaches to the 50% off the summer seasonal aisle coupon. So I think I'm going to grab a couple of these and then try to see if I can use the buy one get one coupon and see what happens. So, hoping is going to happen is I'm going to grab two. So, two of them are going to be $3.94. And then the $3.30 should come off since two of them is, you know, greater than $3.30. And I should pay $0.64 cents for the pair. Even if that doesn't work out, it would be two for $3.94, which is still a pretty good deal on those. So, I guess we'll see when I get to uh, check out. Okay, so this time around, I'm going to do the degree deodorants they're the same deal as the dove deodorants buy one get one 50 percent off um i'm gonna try these and see if these ones do the glitch so i have a four dollar um paper coupon off of two and then i have a 250 off of one digital coupon that should come off so i should pay 488 for the pair so and get back sorry and get back my two dollar extra bucks which would make it 288 for the pair or a dollar 44 each I forgot to record over in the aisle, but I grabbed two of the off clean fuels at $10.79 each. I'm going to use two 
paper coupons for $3 off and then I'm going to submit to Ibotta for $6 back and I'll get the $5 back in extra bucks and it'll bring the cost down to like $4.58 for the pair. Um, so we'll see how that one works out. But this is my cart for my 10 off of 70 I think I'm at like $88 so we'll see what happens. Okay, here's my receipt on this one. I have the Garnier on top, the Febreze, small spaces, um, the Degree Sprays, the Two Secret, and then the CoverGirl and the Off. So all my coupons scanned just fine. I had a lot of favorite coupons for this one. And then my Secret Digital came off, the Garnier's Glitch, the 10 off 70 came off, the 3 off 2 came off. That 50% off did not come off, but that's okay. I used 2601 in extra bucks, paid a subtotal of 14.58. I got back two for Garnier, two for Garnier, two for Degree, five for the off, and nine for CoverGirl. So I got back $20 in extra bucks, and then I submitted to Ibotta, and I got back $6 for the off, and then $2 for the secret. So I got back $8 on Ibotta, making this receipt a cost of only $12.59. Okay, so now I'm looking at this Maybelline deal. Uh, Maybelline or L'Oreal is buy two, get five, or buy three, get eight. So I'm going to grab two of the lipsticks at $7.79 each. Two at $7.79 each equals... Give me one second. Fifteen fifty-eight, and then I'm gonna use this five-dollar printable coupon, which will bring me down to ten fifty-eight. Then I have a three-off ten cosmetics, a three-off any L'Oreal or Maybelline, and a three-dollar digital on here. So that'll take another nine dollars off. It'll bring me down to paying just a dollar fifty-eight, and then I'll get five dollars back in extra bucks. So one of my accounts still had that $3.30 digital on it. So I picked up two Febreze. I used the paper buy one, get one coupon and the digital came off. So it brought my subtotal down to $1.28. I paid $1.97 and got two Febreze. Okay, so I came to a different store to do this 10 off of 70. I'm starting with this. I just told you about that deal in the last clip. But I came here because I was looking for this True Skin Serum. It's $19.49. When you buy one, you're going to get $5 back in extra bucks. And we have a $4 coupon on the app, which will bring it down to $10.49. Then you're going to submit to Ibotta and get $6 back, which brings it down to $4.49. Then you're going to submit to Swagbucks for $2 back, brings it down to $2.29. And then you're going to submit to Checkout 51 for four dollars back and it's going to make it a dollar 51 money maker but i'm adding this into my 10 off of 70 transaction so it's going to be an even better deal i picked up the garnier again the whole blends and the fruitiques for this transaction also and then i'm going to pick up the dove deodorant again um i think i'm going to grab whoops two of these i don't have this scent so same thing uh it's gonna be 14.23 7.99 will come off i don't have a crt or and the digital is not glitching so i'll pay six something and get back the two dollar extra bucks so they'll be about two dollars each now I'm in the cereal aisle and select cereals are $1.99 this week. So I picked up two Lucky Charms. They're $1.99 each. Two of them is $3.98. I'm going to use the $1 digital, bring it down to $2.98. Then I'll get $1.50 back on Ibotta for buying two. It'll bring it down to $1.48 or just $0.74 cents each. So then I'm going to grab two of the Gatorade Fast Twitches. I have a dollar paper coupon from coupons.com for each of them. So that should take $2 off. So it'll be two for $2.50. Then I'll submit to Ibotta and get a dollar back for buying two. So it'll be two for $1.50. It'll make them both just 75 cents each. And then that way I will be right at 70. So we can go use my 10 off 70. So here's what my card is looking like. I'm going to go up front. This is the last transaction I'm doing today. So let's see how it works out. All right, guys, here's my receipt from the last transaction. You see all of the Garniers up top, two of the fast switches, which my dollar paper coupons didn't scan, so she price mod them. 
Then my two Lucky Charms cereals, my two Dove deodorants, my Maybelline, and my True Skin, which this worked out to be an even better money maker than I thought. It worked out to be a $9 money maker, but I'll explain that in a minute. All my paper coupons came off just fine. My True Skin digital, digital, my Maybelline digital, my Garnier's glitched. I guess I had a Fast Switch digital that came off. Um, my General Mills cereal, my 10 off 70, my 3 off of cosmetics came off my three dollar instant crt for the maybelline or l'oreal didn't come off but that's okay i used 2501 in extra bucks paid a subtotal of a dollar 26 so i paid out 26 27 i got back sorry guys um two dollars for the dove two dollars for whole blends two dollars for the fruit teaks five dollars for the true skin and five dollars for the maybelline so i got back 16 dollars in extra bucks so then i submitted to ibotta i got 850 back on ibotta then i submitted to checkout 51 i'm not sure if this one's gonna go through but i submitted there for four dollars we'll see i submitted to swag bucks for four dollars and then I submitted to Fetch for $5.50. And all of those were for the True Skin. So I ended up, we're going to say without Checkout 51, I would get $34 back. So it would be a $7.73 moneymaker. If the Checkout 51 goes through, then I would get $38 back, making it $11.73 moneymaker. And I am officially done with CVS right now. So I'm going to go home and set up. I'll show you guys the haul and we'll talk final cost. All right, guys, I'm back at the house now. And this is my CVS haul for this week. Um, on a slower week, I still did really good. And I know I talked about literally everything here in the store. But two things I want to go over. This, I did a mistake on i thought it said you would get back three dollars in extra bucks on the sign but that was not correct it was saying that there was the three dollar coupon online so these are 7.99 buy one get one 40 percent off so 7.99 and 480 equals 12.79 you have a one dollar digital coupon that'll come off and then the instant crt for three dollars will come off bringing it down to eight dollars and 79 cents and then you'll submit to ibotta for two dollars back and it'll make your final cost 6.79 or 3.39 each so that was the first thing i wanted to talk about second thing i wanted to talk about these are on clearance you do not get the ten dollar extra buck back for them i'm gonna try to call customer service see if i can get it because that would be amazing um and then this so in store i told you guys the scenario i was talking about i know i've seen this on crazy deals and steals so shout out to her but it worked out much better so it's 1949 to start there's a four dollar coupon in our app and then you get five dollars back in extra bucks so that brings you down to just 1049 then you submit to checkout 51 for four dollars Submit to Swag Bucks for four dollars. So now we're just at like a dollar, and then you submit to Ibotta for six dollars, and then to Fetch for five fifty, and it makes it a nine dollar and one cent money maker after your five dollar extra buck back. So I just wanted to clarify on that deal for that. Okay. Okay, you guys, so final numbers for everything behind me. Today, I saved $374.56. My cost came out to be $10.77 for everything. I have 49 items, and that works out to be about $0.22 cents an item. Now, if I call customer service and I do end up getting that $10 extra buck back, then my cost would only be $0.70, cents, $0.77 cents for everything. Um, so I don't know if I'm going to call or not, but for Slow Week at CVS, this turned out really 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 good um i might go back and get another true skin on a different account because that's crazy it's a nine dollar money maker for that and that stuff's supposed to be really good but uh i just want to thank everybody for coming with me on my first ever in-store cvs video for you guys um i hope you enjoyed it there were a few little hiccups but hopefully i'll just get better in time 
Um, if you guys aren't subscribed, please subscribe. Please like the video. Please comment. Um, share with anyone who you think might like these videos or might like to save money. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching.